Welcome to Sac City's Chautauqua Pavilion. I am W.J. Gordon, a local contractor who built this building that certainly has withstood the test of time. Needless to say, I was a little panicked when Mr. Bailey approached me about completing this large building in less than three months. The local residents spent more time than that squabbling about purchasing the land. Finally, on April 15, 1908, there was a site for the building. Mr. Proudfoot of the famous Iowa architecture firm Proudfoot and Bird hadn't even completed the plans. Where was I to get 35 foot tall timbers to support the roof? How could we have it completed by the beginning of July for the Chautauqua shows? The plans came quite quickly. I was able to get some of the timbers shipped upriver from Fisher, Louisiana. My men and I worked like the beavers that made dams in the North Raccoon River to get it built. 80,000 board feet of lumber, 120 squares of shingles, and more than a ton of nails were sawed, hoisted, and hammered together to produce what Mr. Proudfoot termed an auditorium with perfect acoustics. Some people grumbled about the $3,475 price tag, but I can assure you I did not get rich off this project. In 1939, workers from the Work Projects Administration put in a concrete floor, built up the side walls, and screened in the sides to keep the pigeons out. I am proud to say the stage my workers and I built became a platform for fav famous speakers. John Philip Sousa's band, Madame Schumann Heink, and other wonderful singers and countless preachers. Most importantly, we created a place that has welcomed thousands of people to Sac City and still serves as a monument to the Chautauqua movement that brought joy and education to generations of area residents. Thank you for visiting. Be sure to check out the ceiling in the auditorium and imagine building it with no power tools.